In this video tutorial, I'll show you how to use the dual audio mode, which allows you to connect two Bluetooth devices, whether it's two Bluetooth speakers, two Bluetooth earphones, and this is for the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus with the latest Android 13 One UI 5.0. So to get started, first things first you wanna do is pair up both Bluetooth speakers. So we'll go ahead and start with this device here. This is the JBL Go To speaker. So I'll go ahead and turn it on. All right, and we'll get it into pairing mode here. So we'll go ahead and press the uh, pairing button here. And while it's doing that on your Tab S7 here, we'll go into the Bluetooth settings and go ahead and long press that. That'll take us into where we need to be. You'll see the Bluetooth um, names show up here. So go ahead and pair that up. So go ahead and tap that one time. It'll say pairing. You'll get a pairing request here. Go ahead and press pair up. Now you got this all set up. Now we'll go ahead and pair up the next Bluetooth device. This here is the Altec Lansing here. We'll go ahead and power that on. And this usually goes into pairing mode automatically with a long press on the power button. So go ahead and pair that up. Powering on. Welcome to Altec Lansing. So that's pairing mode now. And your device, you'll just need to get it into pairing mode so it can show up on your Tab S7. All right, so this is the other one here. We'll tap on that, we'll pair it up and when you have them both selected here, you will notice that they are both in the blue color text or whatever your color palette settings is, okay? Now to get them to work in sync at the same time here, here's what you're gonna do. So now you wanna go ahead and use the quick panel access and you're looking for the device control media output section. Make sure these two are available. If they are not there, what you're gonna do is go into the three dots right here and go to quick panel layout. As you are here, you'll go to device control media output buttons right here and make sure it's set to show always. This way it can be available whether you pull it down once or twice, you'll have access to these two here. But what we really need is the media output right here. So as I select that now, you will see the two Bluetooth connected devices are here ready to use. The last one you connected would be the default one that has the audio coming through or as the audio output. But if you want both to be used at the same time, you'll go ahead and check the circle here. And now you'll notice you'll be able to adjust the volume for both devices. So what I'll do now is play a video here or some song here just so you can get an idea of how it sounds when both are playing. All right, so they're both playing now. And what happens when you bring up the volume on the Tab S7 here, you'll notice you can control both of them at the same time. You just gotta catch it quick. So as you're bringing up one of them, you'll see the uh, name of the one that you're adjusting. And then if you select the other one, you'll see the name of the other one you're adjusting. So you can play them as loud as you want, but just be careful. All right. Okay, and that's pretty much it. That's how you enable the dual audio mode after the Android 13 when you wipe 5.0 Samsung Tab S7 Plus. Like, sub, and thanks for watching.